Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in uh, Queens in New York City with the uh, Vampire Dave as he, well, attempts to film inside another library and ends up getting kicked out on his ass. Okay then, uh, Davey boy, uh, is it your intention to get kicked out of every single building in the city of New York? I mean, is that even possible? Well, I don't know, Davey, but maybe you should put that on your bucket list. But at any rate, guys, let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. This is a big library. We're in the Flushing, Flushing Queens Library. It's a big library. It's Hey, Davey boy, uh, correction, uh, I know you're illiterate, so, well, you say you're illiterate, but it's not a library, it is a library. Yeah, I know, I know, it's uh, hard for you to pronounce it properly, because I don't think you made it past the third grade, am I right? And therefore, uh, your speech skills, your pronunciations, yeah, they're not very great to begin with, so let's carry on, shall we? Security. Please don't take pictures of yourself, sir. Please don't take pictures of yourself. Yeah, ignore the security guard, little vampire. See how far that gets you. Oh, wait. It's a snowballing effect from this point on because he ends up getting kicked out of here for his own incompetence. We have some Mets fans. Oh, yeah, that's real important stuff that a, a resident of New York would be a New York Mets fan. Uh, yeah, that's real riveting right there, uh, Davy boy. So much so that I'm going to skip most of your content because it's either uh, circular reasoning or dead air or whatever. So let's just jump on ahead to right before the police show up, shall we? Because this video is Damn near an hour long. Many unbearable hours later. You could record the materials, right? Yeah, I mean, it's probably online, too, actually. You know what, actually, this is only... I don't think this has any amendments. Hi, sir. Hi, how are you? Uh, you know, this is I'm grateful. So, the only thing is we got a call about recording. That you're recording okay. the library. There's a policy that's mm -hmm. in the front that says you can't take videos. Okay? I don't know we have the policy. Yeah. So you can't violate the so policy like, of the library? You know, the policy can't violate the Constitution. No, I know, but you have to follow oh, you the know. policy of the yeah. establishment that you're in, okay? You can't, you can't put policy over law, ma'am. And you definitely can't put policy over the Constitution. Yeah, but you can't, you can't break that policy, or they're going to ask you to leave, I can't, okay? I can't break the law, ma'am. No, if I'm not breaking the law, the policy, okay? I am, I am. Okay, but you're not I have their policy, I actually have their policy in my pocket. Okay. <laughs> you know, Davey boy, uh, I seem to remember another time that you showed the policy and, well, it didn't exactly say what you thought it said. In fact, you quote mind it or just didn't read it in, in its entirety. So let's have a little bit of a flashback to that time when you utterly fell flat on your face. Flashback. We're on every single floor that you're recording them and you're being a nuisance. Oh, you want them to read the policy? Well, uh, let's take a look at this right here. It says, well, it's okay for uh, personal use. But this is not personal use to begin with, uh, Davey Boy, because you are going to post it on the internet, or you already did post it the inner to the internet. And looky what it says right here. It says they reserve the right to restrict the uh, filming as necessary, as it may become a disruption to everybody else. And guess what? You were disrupting everybody else. So why don't you make like a tree and leave? Because this policy is not exactly helpful toward you right now, dude. In fact, 
Yeah, you are an idiot. End of flashback. I came from the Queen's Library okay. where they called the cops on me. Okay. And the cops arrived and they honored their oath to the Constitution. Yes. I'm not being disorderly. I'm not committing any crimes. No, no, that's I'm, why I'm not, coming, not, that's why I'm not I'm, yelling at you or anything. No I'm argument. utilizing yeah, the library yeah. the way it's meant to be used. So it's time, place, and manner. Time is public hours. The place is a public building. Yes. And the manner is professional. No, of course. Yeah, I'm not breaking I'm not the law, no, so that means I have a right to not. be here. Yeah, I know. And I, I have their, actually I just, have their policy. The only reason yeah. I came is, like I said, there was a call. No, they don't fine. want you breaking that policy, so I just brought up I mean, about the policy. I follow the law, ma'am, yeah. honestly. I know. I know. That's why I'm not yelling at you or anything. No. I'm just bringing it up why because if we got a call me? here, we just have to come and address the issue, okay? So this is their, this is their policy. If you look at number 16, that's the Queen's Public Library mm -hmm. policy. That's why I just went through this with another library. Yeah, but they have a sign in the entrance that you can't. That's fine. So you're going to have to... Enter. What if their sign said no black people? Hey, Davy boy, I got a question for you. Why do you continuously use arguments that like this that really have no merit to them whatsoever? Because at present, that would be a civil rights violation right there to have that kind of sign on a building. And that's uh, what this boils down to, that it's a civil rights issue and uh, photography is not a protected class in this country it's at the very least a hobby and uh well uh, a profession for others who who actually know how to film in public without causing a disturbance unlike you a person who well can't seem to go anywhere without creating some form of disturbance it's we unconstitutional. No, exactly. 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 So we we aware what you're doing. We have we the recording too. That's fine. Everything is being recorded. We have the right to record so, in public buildings. Okay. I also have the right to record my government officials. Oh, yeah. I haven't got now one private person on my camera. Mm -hmm. I record what I'm doing, mm -hmm. and I also record my government officials, which mm -hmm. I have a right to do. Yeah. No matter what their policy is, I have a right to do. You can't put their policy over our rights. Period. And the government is not even supposed to make policies that violate the Constitution. My my rights shall not be infringed, it says it in the Constitution. Shall not be infringed. So they call you, I'm hoping you come. I don't mind if they call you because you guys come, educate them. You guys swore to protect my rights. Mm -hmm. So I'm not worried because I'm not committing a crime. I'm peacefully exercising not, my rights. No, you're not committing a crime, but right, so that means I have a right to be here. Building. So they call us to address the situation. What's so we have to explain. What, I understand. What's higher, ma'am? Their rules or your law? No, or the law? That's why, like I said, right. I'm not going to start yelling. I'm not going to start, oh, get out, get out. Anything. I just hope you don't violate my rights here. Well, you don't know what uh, your rights are to begin with, especially with your bastardized uh, interpretation of the Constitution. I mean, where does it say that thou shalt not be trespassed from the local public library if you should become an annoying pain in the ass. I mean, show us where it says that. I don't, because I'm of saying, people's feelings. Yeah, like I said, they I just us, showed you their policy. So we just have to address, I know that you showed the policy, mm -hmm. but because they had the sign on the door and they were upset right. about the recording and stuff, okay. we just have to address, hey, there's a policy that you can't record in here. I know that I'm, I'm walking around with a policy know, in my I pocket. I know, but I just have to address it because we got the call about it. You know what okay, I mean? Right. I just have to reiterate it. No, Even I understand. you already know, it's just part of my job. If I'm getting a call about it, I have to... You have to respond. Yeah, you know what I mean? I understand. Mean? I that's appreciate I that. I'm not going to be hostile or anything. It's just that's their policy. I understand So like I said, I'll talk to him about it again, but I just need to talk to you about it. Okay? You could just remind them of what the law is yeah, and that you enforce law. You don't yeah. enforce policy and that... You can't put policy over the Constitution, period. We have a right to record in public buildings. As long as I'm not being disorderly, I'm not somewhere I'm not supposed to be. I'm utilizing the library the way it's meant to be utilized. I'm not getting any private citizens on my camera, so I'm not even breaking their policy. But Oh, so you're not recording anybody else? No private citizens or anything like that, as you said? Uh, let's just take a little snippet from the other, well, nearly one hour long video that you posted, and let's see if you're lying or not. Flashback. Call the police. Isn't that something? I'm going to use the bathroom, so I'm going to pause the recording. Flashback. It's, it's okay, Davey. We all know you lie. But let's just go ahead and carry on to when the cops show up and boot his sorry ass out the door, shall we? 
many many minutes later yeah, but you, right you so you're violating this. my rights right now you can be recording here i can also. record in public buildings it doesn't matter what their rules are i have a constitutional right to record in public buildings period you doesn't can. matter what their policy right. is so you don't know that it's the first right amendment yeah, I know that. the first amendment shall not so be I'm infringed there's two choices you either violate stop. my rights you either stop or you recording honor your oath and hang out here whatever you need to do i told you i'm not going to stop recording you outside. Or you have to leave. so it's it has to be either or. the only way i'm leaving is if you threaten me with arrest why are you threatening me with arrest, arrest. you have to leave and that's it and if you are you threatening me with no, arrest no no you have to leave so because that means you I have a right to be here that's it. and, and what happens if i don't leave you have to stop recording that's what we said before what happens if i don't stop recording i don't leave what happens i don't have to give you more choices there is no more choices that's it i'm asking i need to know what will happen there is no more choices i give you two choices who's the right? who's the responding officer because i got i'm talking we like mad responding. different people we are responding to the job what happens if i don't stop recording and i don't leave well i'm gonna have to ask security if they want you they want you out of here if he says yes you can't trespass I me from you why if i'm conducting business get, what if I'm conducting legal and lawful business, why would you ask me to leave? It's probably well, looky what we got here, right behind this uh, cop right here. Uh, we have another frauditor, and this one has been with Davy Boy for the past few weeks, getting arrested. Oh, yeah, so it's a big party now, huh? I'm right to be there. Mm -hmm. um, dude, I don't understand what the confusion is. I'm utilizing the library. I came here for a purpose. I hear you, but we got a call that you're filming here. And yeah. they have policy here that you're not supposed to be filming. And as I was telling them, right. that, can you put policy over the Constitution? This People is what been... they have. This is what they have, okay? So if you're not going to comply, we're going to have to ask you to leave. And what happens if I don't leave? If you're not going to leave, then you're going to get arrested for trespass. Okay. All right, so sir? you want me to leave now? Are you asking me to leave yes. now? Yes, please. Okay. No matter that I'm conducting business. Yes, sir. All right. Okay. I need your car, please. And I need no your problem. Cars. No problem. I said now I got standing. That's all I needed. That's all I needed to hear. Hmm? Yeah, we're good. So you guys just violate rights, right? We go, sir. Yeah. Right in the public. Yeah, I need all their cars too. No problem. Yeah. Pops in the heart, okay? Thank you. Thank you, partner. So Constitution. We'll, we'll give it to you outside. I'm, I'm leaving, sir. Right. I have a reasonable Hello. time to leave, right? You see how he's dragging his feet, uh, prolonging this whole thing and everything like that, getting uh, cards, blah, blah, blah. Well, Davey Boy, a lot of frauditors have been arrested in the past for not expediting the process of departure from the building. So you might want to get your rear in gear and get the hell out of there. That's a run. My officer's been talking to you for long enough, sir. Yeah, because I wasn't being detained. I hear you. I wasn't committing a crime. Thank you. I mean, I'll see you on. No, sir. Thank you. We'll finish it downstairs. I mean, okay? she's... Come on, we'll finish it downstairs. Now you guys are rushing me out. Uh, uh, uh. It's crazy. This is what we got. This is what we got. For constitutionally protected activity in public, they violate your rights. What command are they from? A little longer than a few minutes later. That you can't trespass right now. There is no trespassing. So why am I leaving? Out. So why am I leaving? Because I'm giving you the opportunity to walk out. So when can That's I? What you're doing? When can I come back in? can go back in you just can't record that's all it is. oh it's as simple as that he can just go right back in there as long as he doesn't have his camera turned on but yeah that's not exactly gonna work for him ever i mean he'd much rather have his little camera turned on uh for his own safety uh yeah okay davy boy i don't see what's so unsafe about a library to begin with i mean are you afraid one of the librarians is going to uh well come up and pat you on the back because you're a good little boy who read green eggs and ham for the first time oh uh, yeah that kind of thing and though why don't why not they honor... have signs that they don't want you to be recording it that's all that's so, why we all have right. to call so just answer me this question why can you put their policy over the constitution all right why can't you have a good day okay so when can I go back in? When you stop recording, you can go in. So 
So if I come back next week recording, you gonna arrest me? Sergeant? You mean you'd have to ask me to leave again, right? Over and over and over? I didn't get her card, ma'am. You're not slick. That's the right to know act. I need your card. I mean, if you want to violate the law, you could. I just did, though. God bless you. Sano. I need Sano's card. I need your card, Sano. I need your card. And now, well, there you have it. Little Davy Boy, who's not exactly the sharpest tool in the shed, gets trespassed from his local library. So that's one more building down. Uh, how many more buildings in New York are there to be trespassed from? Uh, yeah, can you do that in your lifetime, dude? I mean, I would love to see you uh, do a uh, walk of shame out of every single building in New York City. But unlike you, I actually have a life and a job and everything like that. I don't have time to watch you get uh, trespassed from every single building in New York City. But be my guest. Have fun. So at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?